author of the Myron Boltar series, Harlan Coben brings us a spellbinding thriller shelter. The series began the series being about Myron's nephew, Mickey Boltar, after his father's death and his mother's falling out. He loses the only thing Lena has left, his girlfriend Ashley. After her disappearance, he's determined to find her. With the help of his friends Ema and Spoon, the crew discovers that there's more to her absence than what they thought. In Castleton, New Jersey, this unlikely trio, a star athlete, a goth, and a geek, take part in a journey that will change their lives forever. finds himself in a lot of unwanted trouble over his attempt to find his girlfriend Ashley. Unfortunately, Mikey is often played, uh, played out to be rather a suspect rather than a victim. There's a lot of conflict between Mikey and the law. He, he really is a good guy, but of course, naive as he is, it leads to him to being in the wrong places at the wrong time. My character, Emo, is an odd contributor to the group, but she ends up putting, fitting in quite well. Emo being a rough and tough goth girl, for lack of better words, is intimidating. Well, Mikey isn't exactly the stereotypical athlete. His curiosity often gets the best of him. He acts as the leader, but also needs quite a lot of support to fuel his investigation. And lastly, there's Spoon. Nothing could have happened without him. He's a classic nerd, although useful, and wants nothing more but friends and acceptance. My character Spoon is a wild card to say the least. He's careless with his mouth, but extremely resourceful. The only thing different about Spoon is that he knows absolutely nothing about the butterflies, which act as a symbol for the clues for Mickey and Emma. Spoon knows nothing about it, yet still ends up nearly solving the mystery. 